Welcome to Loretto, Pennsylvania for a Northeast Conference class where both schools look to strengthen their standing with a month left in the regular season. Tonight from Tagal Arena, the Sacred Heart Pioneers visit the St. Francis Red Flash. Dissecting the NEC standing, Stonehill, FDU, and Merrimack lead the way so far. Earlier today, St. Francis Brooklyn slid past Wagner by two and OT. Sacred Heart is situated in fourth. St. Francis just below the Pioneers. Strong start to NEC action. They have dropped the last four all on the road. Break to have you with us on this Thursday night with former Clemson standout Terrence Oglesby. I'm Dave Leto. Six games left before the NEC Conference Tournament. We're going to see two among the top scoring offenses in the conference. And they do it in two different ways. Sacred Heart loves to get out, five out, push the pace, and try to find things in transition. But it's St. Francis. It's all Josh Cohen and the big fella. Traditional big man. We don't see that too often anymore, but he is dynamite inside of eight feet. Top 10 score in the country at 21-3 a game. Right hook, left hook, spins baseline, plays with excellent balance, and this St. Francis team goes how Josh Cohen goes. This is going to be a fun matchup to watch. Yeah, Cohen is 10th nationally in scoring. He paces the NEC, cashing in over 21 per game. He's had some terrific performances we'll get into later on in the broadcast. Galetta scored in double figures in all but one game this year. Great credit on hand. Here in Loretto, in the last meeting, these teams met back on January 16th. Sacred Heart prevailed by three. Bryce Johnson, a double-double in that game. Well, it was a game there wasn't a whole lot of offense, especially for the first 10 minutes of that contest, but it started to pick up. I'm hoping today that we'll have a little bit more precipitation. Why? Because St. Francis can really shoot the basketball at home. That last contest, though, lacked offense. This one, we're hoping it's the opposite way. Yeah, don't be surprised to see Sacred Heart run a little bit on this St. Francis team on the road. The Pioneers have won the last two in the series. They did split the series last year. It's a St. Francis team in white coming in at 8-14, 5-5 five overall. The Red Flash dominated 23-17. In fact, Anthony Latina, who leads Sacred Heart, has never won as a head coach in this building, looking to change that tonight. 0-9 in his career as the head coach. I mean, this is a team in St. Francis. They have weapons. They've dealt with injury, but I feel like everybody across the country has dealt with injury. Today is a big test for them to try to get back on the right foot after dropping four in a row. That's St. Francis. St. Francis is in the white uniform. Sacred Heart on the road in red. Tony Chiazza, Matt Porter, and Earl Walton are the officials for this one. First of four on ESPNU on this Thursday night. Chiazza to throw it up, and St. Francis will control with Ronell Giles Jr. We're underway from Loretto. 